Directors of the parent company of luxury casino Okada Manila file criminal complaints against Japanese tycoon Kazuo Okada and several others over the recent hostile takeover and scuffle in the venue. The directors on Monday, June 6 file kidnapping, serious illegal detention, grave coercion, and unjust vexation complaints against Okada, Filipino businessman Tony Boy Kowanko, and other company officials. Parent company director Hajime Tokuda says he was manhandled out of Okada Manila and taken to an unknown car. On Tuesday, May 31, Okada, Kowanko, and at least 50 private guards and policemen stormed Okada Manila to enforce a status quo anti-order issued by the Supreme Court last April, which is said to restore Okada as chief executive officer, chairman, director, and stockholder. Okada was booted out in 2017 over alleged misuse of funds. Parent company director Michiaki Satate insists the other companies which own Okada Manila do not recognize the gaming tycoon's sham board. The case now puts Okada Manila in a complicated position, having two boards claiming legitimacy. Okada's estranged wife Takaho condemns the violent acts led by her husband. His son Tomohiro sides with his mother. Tomohiro is the majority shareholder of Okada Holdings, the ultimate parent of all the companies owning Okada Manila.